In Kite, Georgia, residents are hoping FEMA can provide relief soon as they were hit by the storm. Camila Williams takes us there. Yeah, I own a machine shop, or did. He's known for helping others. Now, Kite Councilman Kenneth Carroll needs help himself. I'm supposed to be doing welding and fabrication and machining. I, I fix a lot of the, the farm equipment around here. Working nonstop since the storm, Carroll is fixing generators for other families next to the city's water tower, which he checks too. He says after the storm, he and others have put in a lot of work. It took three days to be able to get around to everyone. There's still roads that are closed. Carol hopes FEMA can give water and power to the city. In the coming days, we'll also have a disaster recovery center where people can go and apply for assistance in person. Jacqueline Rothenberg with FEMA says there will be disaster survivor assistance teams in each county helping people. She says FEMA has different types of individual assistance programs, like a serious needs one-time $750 payment, an immediate needs, and a displacement assistance. If you are um, staying with a friend and sleeping on their couch instead of going to a hotel, we can reimburse you for that cost. If you're supporting your friend by ordering meals or food, we can help pay for that. We also have assistance for people that are underinsured. Councilman Kenneth Carroll tells me that this tree that was in his backyard was over 200 years old. And after it fell on his shop, he's not sure how long it'll take to clean it up. I mean, obviously, you can see that my shop is completely demolished. Um, I, um, it landed on my lathe. It landed. It, it crushed several pieces of equipment inside. But he knows there was one man that will support him. God will provide. As he continues to support others. In Kite, Camila Williams, 13 WMAZ News. Rothenberg says Georgians can apply for assistance online at disasterassistance.gov or call 1-861-3362. That number again, 1-861-3362. Carol Councilman Carroll says Kite First Baptist Church is also providing meals to people in need.